This is a collaboration with Times Infinity, a fascinating channel about futurism, technology and space. The link is in the description below, make sure to subscribe him. A superhabitable exoplanet is a type of planet that could have more flora and fauna during more time than Earth. In other words, it would be more suitable for life as we know it. The exoplanet would have to have a mass two times the mass of the Earth to have better plate tectonics and temperature, and a radius between 1.2 and 1.3 times the radius of the Earth to have a similar density. The more massive the exoplanet, the higher the gravity. However, a recent study shows that, with training, humans could survive long term in an exoplanet with a gravity four and a half times higher than Earth. The atmosphere of a superhabitable exoplanet would be more dense than Earth, with a higher concentration of oxygen. The color of the sky would be pale blue, similar to the color of the sky here in summer. The oceans would be more distributed and shallow, with a turquoise blue color. The average surface temperature would be around 25 degrees Celsius or 77 Fahrenheit, which is about 10 degrees Celsius or 18 degrees Fahrenheit more than Earth. More clouds and rainfall would be present, resembling the tropical weather of the Caribbean islands. The vegetation would cover more regions, and the color of the plants could be purple. Ideally, the exoplanet would have to be located closer to the middle of the habitable zone, which could result in less illuminance compared to the Earth. With respect to the store, it would have to be a K-type main sequence store with an age between 4.5 and 7 billion years. K-type stars usually emit less ultraviolet radiation than the Sun, and they are on the main sequence during more time. So far, we have not discovered an exoplanet that satisfies all of these requirements. The most similar one is Kepler-442b, but it is located more than 1000 light years away. Nonetheless, there are many nearby K-type stars that could have superhabitable exoplanets. Considering that this type of star is more common than the Sun, there might be more superhabitable exoplanets than Earth-like planets. The closest K-type star that could have a superhabitable exoplanet is Epsilon Indy, located 12 light years away. Epsilon Indy is 1.4 billion years older than the Sun. In this star system, a superhabitable exoplanet would have an orbital period of around 150 days. To watch a comparison between different exoplanets, click the link in the description below and make sure to subscribe to Times Infinity. Here there is a short introduction to his channel. Hey everyone, this is Times Infinity. Be sure to check out my channel for a size comparison on exoplanets after this video is over. On Times Infinity, we explore a range of topics such as cosmology, the future, and artificial intelligence. Now, over to the Exoplanets channel, and thanks for listening. Thank you very much for watching, and please consider subscribing to my channel.